you guys today, we are going to stop at a little coffee roasters called Cutolus Roastology. And I've heard about this place. It's kind of got some really cool things about it, according to what I've read online and the pictures I've seen. This is a really cool place. So come on, let's go. Gallegos. I'm the owner and roaster here at Cut Boat Coffee, 1208 Rio Grande Boulevard in Albuquerque. And we built this place from the ground up as a tribute to my late father who passed away in 2008. He loved fishing and loved the outdoors and I found a way to combine my uh, passion for coffee with the memory of my dad and everything he taught me. So it's, it kind of combines fly fishing with, with coffee and it's amazing how many people are, are attracted to both of those things. So it doesn't matter if you don't like coffee or don't like fishing, we have some for you here at Cut Bro. And it's, a, it's a labor of love and, and we really enjoy being part of the Albuquerque uh, coffee scene. It's really thriving and it's wonderful to be part of such a, a great community of coffee roasters here in Albuquerque. And we donate 10% of all the proceeds of our bags that we sell here to the Hermit's Peak Watershed Alliance, which is up in northern New Mexico where my dad spent so much time in the outdoors. There's a way to preserve uh, the, the, the integrity of the, the water up there for preserve it for future generations of, of New Mexicans to enjoy. So come on down and visit us here at Cup Oak Coffee. We'd love to see you. So as you can see, we've got a couple little pastries today. One of them was a prickly pear, and the other was a uh, peach cobbler thing. Both of them amazing, both of them gluten-free, both of them vegan. I'm not much into vegan and gluten-free, but that was some good stuff. We got a mocha today, pretty leaf put on top. The guys were great, they were laughing and talking to us. And then on top of that, I got the spring blend. The way they roast their beans, old school, not computerized. You can definitely feel the artisan flavors behind them. So if you get a chance, get on down here to Cut Bow, go say hi to Paul. I think you'll be really impressed, right? All right, guys, I gotta go. So remember, if you enjoy the content here on Crafty Coasters, don't forget to subscribe, share, and like. We'll see you next time.